Hi, welcome back to Fake It To You, Make It Or High. If you're new, I'm Katie. Today we are decorating my Happy Planner Classic Vertical. I've used this as a journal off and on throughout this year. Um, and I haven't used it in a little while now. And I don't know, the last couple of weeks I've just had the itch to journal a little bit. And of course, fall and Christmas and all the seasonal things, Halloween, Thanksgiving, it's my favorite time of year to decorate. So I think I want to use this Love Every Season um, Happy Planner uh, Squad Girls book. Um, I haven't used this yet, I don't believe, for fall. So I'm excited to kind of put this to use. Like, look how cute. Ah. Oh, uh. Okay, so I'm really, I'm very excited to use this. I used it for summer. Okay, so let us, let us begin. I don't know. Oh, I kind of like, it's fall, y'all. Keep warm and snuggle up. I just want to pick like a main sticker to kind of go with. And then, because like there's greens. Um, I think we're going to go with this color palette though. I also love that there is a cat because I also have a cat. Her name is Rembrandt for those of you who don't know. Um, so yeah, we're going to, we're going to do that. I don't want it to do sticker per se because again, this is, um, oh, there is much to celebrate. I like this girl carving the pumpkin. That sticker is really cute. Okay. Okay. I think I have, I think I know what I want to do here. So, um, is that two? Same, same. We'll use this one. Anyway, we will start here. Yeah, I've just been kind of in the mood to, um, to journal a little bit and um I don't know I've been reading a lot more and I don't know I just really feel the urge to want to read more and um journal more and I, I feel like when I'm in a really good place I'm I'm doing these things right um getting a little more a little more physical movement in and things like that so I'm really trying very hard to kind of get back to some of these things um and trying to figure out where I can fit some of this into my day-to-day -day life um and still have time you know spend that time that I need working and with my family and those that I love so that is always the goal, you know, but I really miss journaling and I feel like also like the height of 2020, you guys will have to let me know if you felt this way. I was enjoying decorative planning so much. Like it was my favorite thing to do. Um, it kind of was an escape for me to escape the stuff that was going on in the world and I really enjoyed it. And I think sometimes this, like doing a little journaling and a little decorating in your planner, it kind of kind of brings me brings me back to that time, if you will. And it's just nice to, um, you know, just do it for the fun of it because it's fun, you know. Let me get rid of this line here so we don't have a line through her head. I really just love that she's carving a pumpkin. Very cute. There we go. Which we did not go to an apple orchard this year. Shelby's trying a gluten-free diet. Um, so once, once in a while she's having some, some cheat time, but otherwise she's trying, I think, not to. Um, I think we're going to use this girl in this corner because I want them facing each other. Um, so I didn't want to kind of push the apple orchard thing. So I think we're kind of a little late for that. Um, I mean, we could have gone apple picking. I don't know. It just fall. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like the second fall hits, it is just craziness. So you'll have to let me know if you have 
felt that way as well. Um, I think I want to use this over here on the weekend. Um, maybe kind of, what, what sticker am I putting in this corner? I think she is. I just want to make sure I'm not going to be overlapping, but I, yeah, she'll be mostly there. So maybe we'll kind of put this like right here. And again, that's just to journal a little bit. Anywho, um, I don't even know what I was saying, what I was rambling on about. Oh, the pumpkin patch. So hopefully, though, we can take some time to go to a pumpkin patch or um, just do something fun. Maybe a haunted house this year. I don't know. We'll have to see what the the kids' schedules. It's so hard to get them um, when they're both not busy. That has been a, a big struggle, I think, especially um, this last year. I've, I've noticed it more. You know, Avery didn't come on summer vacation with us this year just because he didn't quite have the vacation time because he wants to do other things. And so it's, that's kind of tough. That's the tough part about... Um, your, your kids growing up sometimes is they have other things sometimes they want they want to do. Um, so, oh, Lord. But hopefully we can get to a pumpkin patch because I think that would be fun. Apple orchard pumpkin patch, whatever, whichever. I'm good with either. All right, so we have those. Um, I love this little kind of the stack of books. I think we're going to put those here maybe. Yeah, I think we'll put those there. Also, I'm all about the cats. Very cute. I feel like this cat could also just be kind of lounging on the books maybe. And then, then what over here for her? We'll do like a teapot and some of this. Anyway, so I'm just feeling like all the fall vibes I want to, I'm like feeling the itch to go do all the fall things is basically the very, very long, um, winded <laughs> point there. Good grief. Um, so that's where, that's where I'm at with that. Um, I'm just kind of wanting to enjoy, enjoy the season. And these stickers are definitely giving me the fall vibes. Okay, so that is where we are. We're still in place there. Very good. Um, home is where my books are. Okay, I really want to use this. And I feel like it's kind of going with these, the similar kind of a, a vibe. Um let me see. I love this. Hello, fall. Mm. Home is where my books are. I don't want to use up too much writing space. I think we're actually going to put her down here with a little... Hello fall right there. Um, I just, I'm definitely in my reading era, so I'm all about all the, like, fun, bookish reading stickers. I'm, I'm very much about that. Um, that one is red, though, so, hmm. I think we're gonna do that. I kind of hmm, don't necessarily want to use this one. It's hard because the that's red there. I feel like that's too much red. Um. Oh no. Ugh. Oh my gosh! I thought that was gonna. I thought it was gonna rip. I thought we were. We were ripping. Okay. So we have that. This I'm just not feeling. 
I don't know. I think it's because it's too much red right there. I wish you guys were here to tell me what you think. Decisions, decisions. Yeah, see, I don't like that there. Um, let's put this back. Again, I don't want the to-do, but you know what? We can do, I'm just going to put this here. I don't know where I got that from. We're going to do a little, a little sticker surgery, and I'm just going to cut off this top to-do. There we go. kind of lay it that way and then can I save this to do we'll just stick it back in there and then I really want some fall foliage or something in here um, I think that was back here here we go yeah just to kind of I think um, Bring it, bring it all together. I think we'll do a darker floral over here. Put that mustardy color. Okay, I have to use the mushroom, you guys. It's too cute. Very cute. Um, we have like this golden leaf. Mm. Decisions, decisions. No, maybe over here we do this. Anyway, let me know what is your favorite fall activity. I also want to, there is um, a place, it's called Greenfield Village. It's here in Michigan and they do like a Halloween. They also do like these Christmas things um, and the tickets always sell out so quick. I would like to, I'm, I know it's too late for the Halloween stuff even though it's still several weeks. I feel like it just sells out really quick. Like the weekend days, you probably could, the weeknights are probably a little bit easier, but it's about, I think it's like a 45 minute drive from us. So I don't know that I would want to go on a weekday. Also, I don't know that my kids could go on a weekday. Um, or like my niece and nephew who I would maybe, you know, want to go with. So, oh, the struggles. Of trying to find the time to do all the fun things. I just want to live my life like I'm in a Hallmark movie, okay? You guys, is that too much? Is that too much to ask? Apparently, yes. Yes, it is. Um sorry, I, I don't know why. I can't decide where I want to put this, but I feel like I need something else. So we're just waiting out everything. Um and seeing what I think because there's stuff down there I'm kind of feeling no I don't think I need this anywhere else I don't know what are you guys thinking I think I'm gonna put that back I have there's green leaves too I feel like green is not as fallish to me as these other colors which I think is the problem maybe here I don't think it needed that, but <clears throat> what's done is done. So I think we'll just leave it like that. That's perfect, though, because I have plenty of space still to, to write and journal, which is really the point of this, is to look cute, to make me want to come back to it, to journal during the week and kind of write my feelings down and kind of what's going on and keep memories and all that good stuff. So I use this Happy Planner Love Every Season um, Squad Girl sticker book. Very cute. This came out maybe it wasn't this fall. Maybe it was the summer. I don't remember when this came out, but here is the, the um, skew if you need it to find it. And I am a Happy Planner affiliate. So if you do choose to shop, please think about using my affiliate link. I always appreciate your support, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what your favorite fall activity is down below. 
a good fall book rec. Those are always very welcome here. So leave those down below. And I hope you guys are having a great week planning your best life. And I will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.